Hello and welcome to the video by Trump Excel. I am Sumit Bansal and in this video I will show you how to use the replace function in Excel. Here I have some data in cell A2 and E3. Now let me show you how replace function works. So I type R E P and note that Excel prompts the name of the function as I type. So I hit tab to auto complete the function. And replace function takes four arguments. So first is old text where you want to replace some string start number is the start number character in that text where you want to start the replacement number of characters is the total number of characters you want to replace and new text is the text with which you want to replace those characters so let me show you how this works i select a2 as the cell reference which is the old text in start number i give 5 which means that it will start from the fifth character which is a b c d e e is the fifth character so this will start replacing from e in number of characters i give 4 which means that it would take four characters starting from e so it will take e f g and h and in new text i want this to be replaced by an asterisk sign so it will take e f g h and it will replace it with an asterisk sign so let me hit enter and you can see that it has replaced those four characters now let me show you another way to use replace function so here i have an email id trump excel at gmail.com and i want to extract only the username and i don't want the second half which is at the end gmail.com so to do that i can use a replace function i type R A P L A C and I hit tab. In the old text, I use the cell reference A3. In start number, I give it as 11. Now, if you count Trump Excel, these are made up of 10 characters, and 11th character is at the rate. So I want this to get eliminated at the rate gmail.com, and hence I start with the 11th character. And I want to remove, remove 10 characters, which is at the rate gmail.com, which are a 10 character string and the new text is a blank so when i hit enter it gives me the username trump excel and it removes at the rate gmail.com now while you are allowed to give the start number as a positive number you cannot give a zero or a negative number as the starting position so now let me show you if I use the same thing, I use A2 as the old text. And in case of start number, I give minus 1. Let me give number of characters in 4 and this as start. Now, if I hit enter, it gives a value error because I have given the starting position as negative 1. And Excel cannot start from minus 1. Excel can always and always start with 1 or more than 1. Similarly, if I again use A2 as the old text, start number as 1, and if I give the number of characters as minus 1, and this, the new text, text as asterisk, this would again give me a value error because Excel would need this value, the number of characters, to either be 0 or a positive number excel does not know how to replace a negative number of characters so it gives you uh, a value error let me show you what happens if i put a zero here if i put a zero here it puts that asterisk sign at the beginning of this text why because i have given the number of characters as zero and the start number as one so it goes to the first character, it begins from the first character which is A and it has to replace no character but it just puts the asterisk sign there. So this is how replace function works in Excel. I hope you found this useful. Thank you and have a nice day.